Tonight is Wonderland at Ministry of Sound. We're at Elephant and Castle in London town. It's going to be an absolutely excellent night. The music's already pumping. We're going to go through the crowd, see what, what's happening, what everyone's up to. See if we can get hold of some of the DJs, get some fantastic footage so you can see what it's like to be in Ministry of Sound. Make it happen with Manchester Music Base. Check this out. Scotty just said, uh, I can't roll my arse, but I can play the spoons. I was like, yeah, really? What are you going to do? Try and get your message across in Morse code. I genuinely, genuinely can play the spoons, though, honestly. That's me playing. That's, in, that's my imaginary that's, playing that's, the spoons. That's, that, yeah, that's like, sounds like a banjo or something. <laughs> a banjo. I'll play the banjo if you play the spoons and let's yeah, see if yeah, you can yeah, get yeah, Stella definitely. somewhere. <laughs> Spoon step. Oh, uh, what's Barefoot Scan Wednesdays? Barefoot Scan Wednesdays every Wednesday on Magnificent Mornings, uh, right, now right. Magnificent Afternoons. We don't do hump day. Good, It's all good. about peace and love. Good. And it's all about good vibes. So we it's have, all about uh, getting your feet out. Yeah, we all have Barefoot Scan Wednesday. We just have to throw your shoes in the bin because they get in the way of the skanking. <laughs> yeah. So we just all go in, throw our shoes in the bin, and we just go off wherever we are, me and the Magnificent Morning crew. <laughs> Even if you're in the office... Dudes in full suits with the shoes off. I've seen it. They sent me pictures. Big. Dancing in the office. Big. Kids at home going in. Little two-year-olds. Somebody's grandma having a barefoot <laughs> skank. That's what it's all about. So I still had this void in me. Yeah. Trying to figure out what it was. So I said, man, if I die tomorrow, people know my musical legacy. Mm. They know what Run DMC did. First to go gold, first to go platinum, first to Rolling Stone, first on MTV, first to, you know, first with the sneaky, all that again. But I said... The, the kids of this generation don't know about the little boy Daryl who became DMC. Yeah. Why the brothers love me? Why the mothers love me? They know, you know, it's tricky and walk this way, but they don't know about the little boy Daryl. So I said, I'm going to write a book just in case if I die tomorrow, you know, if I really mm. OD, like I was drinking heavily, yeah. and if I do commit suicide, nobody I'll knows about Daryl. Let me let Daryl on. So I just basically called my mother up and said, I just need to know three things. How much did I weigh? What hospital I was born in? And what time I was born? And she told me those three things. Thank you, thank you, love you, love you. Mm -hmm. Hung up the phone. Hour later, she called back with my father on the phone. Dara, we have something else to tell you. Oh, okay, my shoot, God. Okay, On the phone, yeah. Blasey, blah, this, blasey, blah, that. You was a month old when we brought you home, and you're adopted. So right then and there, I knew the void That's was what filled. You've been that was a piece of peace. So I was already depressed, alcoholic, and suicidal. So that was really a wake up call. Wow. But Right then and there, I realized something. Oh, that was the void in me. But that's why I was given a foundation of hip-hop. The next track up, we've got... Oh, no, first of all, I need to tell you, I can't stop playing with my balls. Yeah, why have you been messing with your balls but in front of me? But all I can hear is you messing with your balls, Jay. You need to stop... Because they're Christmas jingly balls. Give them a good jangle in front of me. It's so I can't so, stop so jangling my balls. Them. These balls are going to go with me now <laughs> until okay. Christmas Day more. Well, even through to New Year's Eve, I'm nice. going to have my balls everywhere. Well, yeah, you, you, you keep on dangling your balls for everyone. Well, it's it. jingle balls or Christmas salty balls. Everyone else, yeah. Everyone Chocolate else. salty balls. Here comes Jay with her balls dangling around, <laughs> messing about. <laughs> right. They're like a good pair of dangly balls. Anyway, um, what we're playing next, Ghetto Romance. Do you know what? We had, we had like a random picture of Egyptian because Egyptian came in the studio yeah, and we had it knocking around and uh, it was like, I think that might have been a signed picture. We're like, what are we going to do with this? It's quite nice. I thought, we'll have it in the ladies because I don't think the guys really want to see it so, well, so much. We kind of fancied him, you see. Ah, right. I think we'll have to get one of them. I can't think who we could have in there. We could have all kinds. Yeah, he's, not, he's not naked. It's just a headshot. Yeah, yeah. Don't try and make it into any more than it is, busy. I'm saying nothing. I'm saying nothing. Okay, if you do want to shout out dedication, head. it is 80818. <laughs> Start your <laughs> message with you there. Shout out. Yeah, me one for just. Put me out.